Welcome to our new video. In this video we are going to talk about Infinix Not 12 VIP. So without wasting any time let's get started. This is the VIP looks different feels different and definitely charges different welcome to the review of the Infinix Node 12 VIP. In the container you actually get every one of the frill a glass screen defender and of wired headphones Infinix are as yet a rare example cell phone brands given genuine extras with one pin of critical notes their 120 watt hypercharger which can go from 0 to 100% shortly yet, we'll discuss that a piece later then obviously we have the actual telephone it has a touch of weight to it around 198 grams however that is something to be thankful for on the grounds that it causes it to feel premium. We have the earphone jack one of two mics at type C port and one of two speakers so two speakers on here that is that is very great at the top we have the second speaker as well as the second mic on the right half of the Telephone we have the power button as well as the volume all over keys and on the left side we have the SIM card plate which by the way can hold two 4 grams SIMs as well as a miniature SD card at the front of the telephone we have the expectation punch. Shaper lodging clearly the selfie camera or more that we have the earpiece and truly one truly smart idea that they added was diminishing the bass shin I've whined a ton about that bass jawline and they're at last doing it the objective is to have an entirely balanced top and bass bezel and we are truly closed the front looks way more pleasant now due to how much bezels and the nature of the presentation it's a 6.7 inch 1080p a mold show it likewise has a 120 hertz invigorate rate the showcase is great it looks truly decent you're certainly going to appreciate watching youtube recordings which by the manner in which allows you to watch up to 4k motion pictures two would be perfect on this in addition to like i said it accompanies double speakers so you're truly getting a ton here you actually get an eye accommodating presentation so formally they marked every one of the crates it looks so great so you can see we have android 12 on here which is fabulous it likewise accompanies xos 10.6 which i accept is the most recent now we previously saw android 12 on the hot 11 and presently we're seeing it on the note 12 and yes we really do get some android device highlights there are additionally a few visual changes a few enhancements to subsequent meetups the voice right hand the camera module houses the 108 megapixel fundamental camera it looks pretty colossal close by that is the 13 megapixel ultra wide sensor and a profundity sensor it likewise has laser identification self-adjust the 108 megapixel mode likewise turned out all around well the primary camera the selfie camera is 16 megapixels and albeit the variety isn't generally so terrible as the ultra wide it's not quite as great as the principal camera justifiably it accompanies 8 gigabytes of slam 128 gigabytes of capacity it actually has a possibility for stretched out smash of up to 5 gigabytes making it 13. indeed even while gaming you would feel some vibration which i believed was cool it likewise remained pretty cool more often than not thanks to its nine layer grapheme cooling framework cooling is certainly really significant particularly in this telephone due to its ludicrous 120 watt quick charging which as i referenced goes from zero to 100 of every 17 minutes okay it's a double cell battery so it's charging the two simultaneously so that is the way it's ready to charge this telephone so rapidly we have 103 security highlights traversing from the charger to the circuit to the battery we've likewise got 18 warm sensors which screen the gadget's temperature to ensure you charge securely and as far as what it means for your battery well being great you ought to get around 800 charging cycles which is around two years and around then your battery well-being would be around 85 which is somewhat industry standard so obviously they figured pretty much all of this and they've gotten their work done and research before truly putting this out so i suppose essentially nothing remains to be stressed over i think another justification for why it charges so rapidly is on the grounds that it's a more modest battery at 4500 milliamp hours now assuming that you're a weighty client it would no doubt bite the dust before the day's end however realizing that you can put your telephone down to charge and shortly you can have long stretches of screen on time i figure the vast majority wouldn't see any problems indeed shocking plan fundamentally wonderful showcase the primary camera is great yet the ultra wide selfies actually need tweaking execution is palatable basically it's ideal for customary individuals yet no five grams here and obviously insane quick charging i think the main two things missing would presumably be five grams and like the commitment two or three years of software update if you like the video give the big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe click the bell icon for new videos see you in the next video